Okay. Traitor. He may have bested me, but the last of the four remains. Not gonna lie, I thought her, her uh, hair looked like uh, top of a cobra. With the fangs and all that. It would have been a cool idea, but maybe that would have been too similar to like... Uh, what was that? Robot Master Snake Man? I think he has a very similar sort of idea that I was imagining. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh well. Not that you ever leave this tower alive to beat him. Oh. The tower's collapsing. She left us no escape. Oh, I don't like this one bit. It's fine. We have the teleport spell. Everyone gather near. Yeah, see? Exactly. Teleport. There was zero danger. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I guess that was a sign there was a boss since I couldn't teleport earlier. We're in the bedchamber in Baron. You'll be safe enough here, now that the imposter is gone. Cecil, there's something you must know. And what would that be? It's about the remaining crystals. Okay, we've lost the Earth Crystal. Golbez holds them all now. No, he holds four. You mean to say there are more? What is it, light and dark? <laughs> I'm assuming. Kind of thing of it. I've heard tales of others. You speak of the dark crystals. Oh. I do. The four of this world are crystals of light. Wait, is this... Am I getting what I wanted from three? And for every light, there's a shadow cast. Then, the dark crystals are real? Quite. Gobez holds but half of the crystals. But even if the crystals are... The tales are true, how would we be able to find them? No doubt we will not. Gobez already has. Then we must reach them before he does. Where are they hidden? Where their name implies the deep, dark bowels of the underworld. The underworld? How are we supposed to get there? Start digging? <laughs> yeah. Please, there's more. He said when all the crystals were gathered, the way to the moon would be opened. Ah, yes, of course. <laughs> the way to the moon? I understand it no more than you, but... He said that this is the key. Okay. A stone. There is a place where it must be offered. In doing so, we'll open a path to the underworld. A place? But where? That much I do not know. What's there to worry about? We got the Enterprise. We could fly circles around the world in a blink of an eye. Said the Enterprise is still at the Tower of Zot. <laughs> Thinking old Sid's gone senile on you, eh? I told you, didn't I? The Enterprise's strides beyond the other ships I've already f or rather, I've already floated her back to Baron by remote control. What? Then I believe our course of action is decided. I don't know what we'd do without you, Sid. Be stranded here. <laughs> Me neither. Guess we'll leave in the morning then. No better way to start searching for an entrance to the underworld than a sound night's sleep. I wonder, what made Gobez falter? Something to matter? No, it's nothing. We should get some rest. He felt unwise. Let's be in our way. I, I don't know what's your... Uh, I guess we'll find out eventually. <laughs> oh, because hoping I remember how to get out of this castle. Oh wait, is there a different dialogue now? Never in my darkest dreams did I imagine that a monster sat at the throne. To think we were but pawns in Golbez's hand. The shame is just too much to bear. 
So yeah, so just keep standing there. <laughs> So it is here. Oh, oh, oh I, I should probably buy some items. Oh boy, before I sign up. that much she's <laughs> pretty sure now I just have a Decent amount of items to sell. Uh... Oh wait, no, he he's he's a dragoon. Yeah, there is no point in me keeping the uh, the evil short, I guess. Wonders if the uh, armory got updated here. Oh, oh, it, it is still locked. Oh, wait, don't I? Do I have a key? Why are you here? Oh, Cecil, greetings and salutations. Did you catch wind of my debut? Is that why you come? No? Oh, excuse me then. Uh, I, I just assumed. You see, I recently awakened to my own musical inc inclinations and began to sing whilst wandering about to the world. Having discovered the siren call of music, I have little choice but to abandon the name of Camping Way. My passion now lies in parting hope and dreams to the people of the world through song. Jamming way to Bard. Would you like to hear a song or two before you go? No. I see. Well, you do seem rather busy. Uh, if you if you ever get that itch to uh, that the only music could scratch, you only need you only need to say the word. Yeah. I, I want I want the uh, I want the stuff that's back there. So apparently, through <laughs> the back maybe
I mean, that's what I assumed last time, but I do not know. Alright, well, I'll save and it's time to explore the world, I guess. I mean, could have done that <laughs> when I first had access to the uh, airship, but I uh, didn't want to get too distracted, you know? Yeah, it's likely that we are just, like, finished with uh, this world for now. We just gotta go to the underworld. As you do. There's a cave here. Uh. Oh, Mithril. Shmuel. Oh, you's a big one, ain't ya? Human, I wager. Try not to squish us underneath your boot heels, eh? Boot bo bo heels? Boot bo heels? Eh. Baffles? We swine mind the mithril, the tones refine it, and the small folk do the smithing. They can forge weapons and armor size of humans. Yeah, a real <laughs> talking pig. And not just a dude turn into a pig. Look at the size of you. You some sort of giant or something? No. Oh, I'm average. The girl you must spend on food probably can't afford to eat much more than ant steaks, huh? Assuming they, j they just have mithril items in this uh, shop. Welcome. Oh, 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 oh. Is she? Uh, let's get uh, ten of those. Staff, knife, hammer, sword. Oh, so Kane might have been able to use the um, dark sword that I had. Eh. I don't think I'll find much benefit in giving Rose a, a weapon, you know? Hey. You wanna see real dancing and you came to the right place, oink? What do you say? Don't turn me into a toad or a pig? Or a small? Pretty Mithril Brothers, are you ready for this? This is... <laughs> The same dance, but there's three of them now. Oh. Already done. <laughs> The shield, the helm, armor. Oh. Yeah, let's get two of those. Um, I mean, it's probably all class soon, <laughs> soon enough, but. For now, I'll just waste my money real quick. Hmm. 
Uh, it's hard to balance the magic defense and regular defense. Try and talk to the frog, not find a free knife free knife. Um oh okay. Uh, Alright. Well that was a nice detour. How much money did I waste there? Uh a bit too much maybe. Well, I would have loved to have uh, brought the, the floater. Uh, what was it called? The uh, hovercraft over there, but I'm not really sure how to. Unless we get like cargo or something, we could, we could just drop off uh, other vehicles that we have. I don't think the uh, chocobo would, would work in this situation. Would it? Very unsure. Uh, yeah, this is where we were. Because of uh, us waking up and being turned to a paladin. Yeah, it's be like an island out here that has a volcano on it. Hmm. A guard. This is the village of a guard. You are a people of Dwarven lineage. Oh. I wonder if I'm so short because of my Dwarven blood. I sure wish my ancestors had been ogres instead. <laughs> Do you now? Do you really? Did our forefathers come to live here, you ask? I'll tell you how. They, um, uh, yes, they, uh, dear me, I for seem to have forgotten. Don't remember. Time to waste for more money on armor. <laughs> Let's see. Get the. Uh, ah. Well. Not very, uh, good. <laughs> well. Is it possible to go to that, like, building in the bottom left there? I think I see an indent for stairs, but... Oh. I mean, that wasn't on a map. Yes, you can. Let's see. You could not survive without, without the sun's blessings. 
The same was not true of our distant forebears. Though, no, at least if the stories were to be believed. Eh. Once my husband starts gazing through that telescope of his, he often forgets to even feed himself. This is Sir Koyos Observatory, home to the world's only fully functional telescope. There have been some unsettling changes on the lunar surface as of late, and we are hard at work studying them. Oh. Wait, that's pretty relevant. Um, I'm Koryo, and this is my observatory. From it, I am able to study the moon. Very intriguing, our twin moon. Twin moon. Oh, yeah, right. One is utterly devoid of life, but the other shows unmistakable signs of habitation. And in recent months, the moon's surface had begun to turn crimson, almost as though it had been stained with blood. I hope with all my heart it is no omen of events to come, but I must admit it weighs upon my mind. A heavy load. Can I take a look through? The moon. It's a very oddly <laughs> high-res picture of the moon on <laughs> the DS. 